last day of work for the week um, but I thought it would be fun to do something different and bring you guys through like a full day in my life as detailed as you know I can possibly be um, I'm not doing anything for TikTok today so I feel like that's why I can like just bring you guys in depth because it's hard to do both sometimes um, so anyway it is 7 16 in the morning I woke up at 7 o'clock, my alarm goes off at 7 o'clock, and I usually lay in bed for like 10 minutes before I get up, um, and honestly, I'm looking at my phone, like I usually roll over and look at my phone, which is a terrible habit, and I need to stop, and I know that, um, but I, I'm not ready to stop, so anyway, um, I then made myself a matcha, so for the past like two weeks, coffee has just not been good to me. I don't know why. I don't know if it had to do with like me, my throat feeling bad or anything like that. So coffee's just not been hitting. So today is the second day I've made matcha and I'm very much enjoying it. I just have these little packets that I got from Publix that are not like high quality, high grade um, whatsoever, but it's really good. I'm, I have been enjoying it. Now, usually I will go sit down and do my devotional along with like my five minute journal and give myself just a little bit of time to like wake myself up in the morning and the dogs will sit and like cuddle with me it's super cute i think this is probably the third um five minute journal i've been through i got the first one you know originally i feel like it was really big several years ago and then amazon has done like their own version um so this is still like the five minute journal and i really like it and then this is my devotional. It's just this Max Lucado Grace for the moment devotional. And this is the baby. Cuddling. It's literally 7 a.m. Yikes. So today is actually um, a very different day for me. I've been meaning to film this video yesterday. However, I needed to film something else yesterday um, for a brand. Therefore, it was just gonna be like way too difficult to do both. And I totally forgot about even filming this video. So we're filming this video on, it's gonna be a more fun day. It's basically just gonna be an otter day. Like this doesn't usually happen. I kind of wish it did, but um, I, my husband and I are going to our 10 year high school reunion this weekend and we leave this afternoon. Our flight leaves at 5.45. Um, so my last patient of the day today is, I wanna say like 2.15. I told them I needed to be out of there by three o'clock. So last patient of the day at um, 2.15 should definitely get me out of there by 3 and I'm like working through lunch like I have patients scheduled through lunch all of a sudden my nose has started running so it's going to be a pretty long morning you know 6 straight hours of seeing patients is a lot um, but it's cool it's fine. <laughs> um, and then after that, I'm going to run home, change. I'm gonna have all of my bags packed today before I leave the house. Um, I already packed like all my clothes and stuff last night, so I just have to throw my toiletry bag in my carry-on. So I can't pack any dry shampoo. <sighs> and I didn't buy any little, oh wait a minute literally in my carry-on bag I mean in my um, travel size little makeup bag so that's perfect actually um, so yeah we are leaving tonight we're going to Virginia my husband and I actually met at boarding school in Virginia we went to Shenandoah Valley Academy um, which is ironic because my husband is from Indiana so I always say like it was just meant to be that he went there I was always gonna go there like that was always the plan for me to go there after um, 10th grade because I went to like a little small um, Christian day school all growing up like I went to the same school um, from kindergarten 
through 10th grade and then after that I was gonna go to this boarding school because in my mind this boarding school was giving Zoe 101 now in fact this boarding school did not actually give Zoe 101 except for like the dorms and like living with your friends type of thing but it was way stricter <laughs> like um you couldn't like girls and guys cannot be like touchy in any sort of way but like my husband and I dated all throughout high school like we started dating my junior year like a month after we met each other and we've literally been together since um but you know we couldn't be like holding hands we couldn't be doing anything else where people would catch us essentially so um yeah it's just a fun place i have a lot of fun memories from there i have a lot of not so fun memories from there too um but i just want to you know it's been so long i just want to remember the fun stuff and some of my friends are coming and i haven't seen them for several years it hasn't been 10 years but maybe some of them it has been 10 years i don't even know but we're staying in a house with my roommate from high school who is the best i love her um and then her boyfriend one of my husband's really good friends from high school and then um another friend so it's gonna be super fun seth has a golf outing tomorrow they always do like an alumni golf outing um <coughs> so i don't know what i'm gonna do in the morning because nobody else is gonna be there like my friends are not gonna be there in the morning but i'm sure i'll find something to do um it's a very small area of the world if you are familiar with like the shenandoah mountains uh there is nothing there really so i don't i i might and the thing i find myself doing might be taking a nap in the car because the golf outing starts at 8 a.m but we'll see and then we kind of want to do a bonfire with all of our friends on friday night because most people are getting there then and then saturday morning we go to church and there's like an alumni church event and then probably saturday afternoon we'll all hang out maybe at the place that we got there is this ice cream store that is in newmarket virginia which is where the school is that i will never forget it's called pax and they like have the best ice cream i am gonna have ice cream there i'm so excited and then Saturday night is an alumni basketball game. We're all going to hang out. And then Sunday we leave and we come home. So it should be fun. I think I'm going to do my hair really quick. I'm just going to like put a straightener through it because this morning I woke up to my hair. This side is fine. This side is like kind of wavy. I don't know. I don't know what's going on hair is done i just used this little thing that i got from tj maxx it's so nice it's like a roller wand it heats up i love it, it looks so good um i feel like i'm wasting it on a day of being in the office and then being at the airport but it's cool i like it so silly because i literally planned on vlogging today and i forgot my camera at home it is what time is it it's 12 43 um, I have a weird schedule today, I already mentioned, so I'm seeing patients through lunch. Um, but I just finished my last one and my next one isn't scheduled until 1.15. And we are out of a medication that I need for my 2.15 patient. So I'm running to our other office location to grab that medication and then I'm coming back here. My 1.15 is a televisit, so I should be fine. Um, but... I'm almost done for the day. I think I have like maybe three more patients to do and yes. And then we're checked out for the weekend, baby. I'm so excited. We just got home. I wrapped up my last patient at probably like 2.20 and ran out the door. We're in my closet right now that has terrible lighting. I'm just going to change into my airport clothes and then we'll be good to go my i don't know if i showed you guys my scrubs for today i don't think i did they were tucked in um now they're untucked but they're from fabletics super cute my undershirt is from fabletics as well they usually look better i like them tucked in but let's chain okay this is the airport fit i feel like you probably can't see it that well 
Um, I'm wearing this McLaren shirt from Abercrombie. This is like my go-to airport fit. And then the easy pants that I show you guys all the time. I literally wear them all the time. They're from Set Active. And my Reeboks, this needs to be dealt with when I get home. Um, but we are good to go. I actually didn't think that I was gonna make it home before Seth, but he's not home. I'm all packed. Sorry, the lighting was weird there. I'm just waiting for him to get home and then we'll probably head out. But there's no rush right now because it's only three o'clock. Our flight leaves at 5.45 and we live 30 minutes from the airport. So we totally fine. <laughs> 